Good morning. This is Pastor Gary from the Orange City Campus at Living Water Community Church, and this is your Wednesday update for February 17, 2021. Let's get started. On the National Calendar Day, February 17 is worth noting because it is considered National Acts of Random Kindness Day. Most popular options to celebrate this day, according to nationalcalendarday.com, include anonymously paying for coffee or a meal for the person in line behind you, writing an encouraging note for someone with no explanation, or sending a thank you card to a fireman, a police officer, or a military personnel. Be sure to celebrate this day however it is laid on your heart. On the larger church calendar for February 17, today begins a season of Lent with an observance day called Ash Wednesday. Typically, ashes are used to symbolize death and resurrection, of course, reminding us of the death and resurrection of Jesus Christ. This Lent season is often seen as a time to give something up as well, to remember what Christ gave up for us. Continue to celebrate the season of Lent as you see fit. Concerning living water in particular, remember that our Sheldon campus continues their first months of children's ministries. Please be in prayer for them and express your support to Pastor Jesse, Director Allison Cook, and the entire campus, however you can. Here at the Orange City campus, there will be no youth group tonight in light of high school basketball. However, we are planning to have a game night on Sunday night instead. A beanbag tournament is scheduled for Friday, February 26. You are able to sign up for that event by contacting Danny Koiken at the email address below. For this Sunday, you can prepare your hearts by studying Romans chapter 13. That chapter concerns submitting to authorities, remembering God is the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords, and also understanding that he is in control. We will also be reminded of words like covenant and sacrament when we celebrate the baptism of Livian Swa. At Living Water, at Living Water Community Church, we seek to follow Jesus by loving God and loving others. Jesus gave those two commandments when questioned what were the most important commandments. And so as a church, we believe that everything we do, everything we ask, everything we say, everything we think can be guided by those two commandments. Our encouragement is to teach you to be asking the same in your personal lives. Is this how I can best love God? Is this how I can best love others? Until Sunday, grace and peace to you. <laughs>